I didn't win the lottery, so I gotta go to work. All right, good morning. We're in Del High, Louisiana. It rained last night. Oh, I did not think it was gonna rain. See all my stuff on the trailer here? Everything got wet. I had a leak in my water heater and I took everything out. Hang on, let, let me get this off. Hang on. All right, so now I got this out of the way. All right, I got it out of the way. I had a leak in my hot water heater. And I had to take everything apart to see what was going on. These are the coolant lines to heat the, uh, the hot water heater. But I bypassed it to see what was leaking. And it wasn't coolant leaking, it was water. I set this down here to see if it was wet and I think I found the leak once the hot water heater would get hot it was leaking right here at that fitting so I think I fixed the problem this little piece of paper is not wet or this paper towel is not wet so that's good so I'm gonna kind of put this back together put all this back in gather up all my wet stuff uh, I did not think it was gonna rain so anyway we'll get started start it up good morning it's Monday morning I think the daylight savings time is messing with me a little bit I had to hang my coveralls on the mirror so they dry out they got wet yesterday Bailey's up and awake oh man I get out check the oil get a cup of coffee we got about eight hours over to where we got to go. All right, I think we're about ready. I didn't win the lottery, so I got to go to work. Oh. We got about oh, 400 miles to go today to get over to Beaufort, South Carolina. We're going to find a truck stop. It should be a truck stop right at the state line of uh, Georgia and South Carolina over by Savannah. That's our goal. Everything looks good. Uh, I did end up driving down through, I think it was 40, 45, Highway 45. Uh, 
that's how I came down yesterday through Mississippi down to Mobile, Alabama and then on over it's a lot more enjoyable drive really enjoyed it back roads less traffic we're on I-10 now we're gonna shoot I-10 straight across Florida over to Jacksonville Get on 95, run 95 north. In 800 I, feet, turn right onto Florida 71 north. I did book a load for tomorrow, Tuesday, out of Savannah, going up to Charlotte. Freight is slow. So I've had to kind of suck it up and do stuff that I really don't want to do. And Charlotte is one of those places I don't like to go to. Charlotte, North Carolina. So, but anyway, I'm going to suck it up. Pays pretty good, though. Considering everything. be a fairly easy uneventful day hopefully we got plenty of fuel It's into the day. It was a quick day. We're over here near Savannah, Georgia, but on the South Carolina side. Hardyville, I think's the name of it. We got um, we got about uh, 30 minutes to deliver. I thought I was going to deliver today, but they called and said no. Here, I want to show you something real quick. See that truck sitting across there? See the name on that door? Interstate Van Lines? That was the first company I leased to when I bought my truck, Interstate Van Lines. I was leased to them for four, five years. That was, that was, uh, <laughs> got a message, hang on. That was uh, 20, one years ago <laughs> a long time ago 21 years ago wow so anyway all right we're done for today we're camped out i don't know if i showed you not we camped out this little truck stop here sun's right in the window that's it talk to you oh. later wait a minute there was two things i wanted to cover i forgot about one was the hot water heater because i know somebody's going to ask about that so the hot water heater is either electric or it uses a heat exchanger meaning that it uses the coolant from the truck to heat the hot water 
Uh, I've been using it just on electric. Um, Cause like I said, I didn't know if the heat exchanger thing was leaking. Uh, what was the other thing I was gonna talk about? Cause I knew somebody was gonna ask. Oh well, well I'll figure it out. 